Here she is, my little tortitude. Here, look at this. Look at this. She is a super, super beautiful tortie. She's got an excellent, silky, tight lying, long hair coat. And the only way you know it's a long hair is if you backhand it. So she's really going to be as low maintenance as a short hair in terms of being very low or no shedding and having silky fur that doesn't mat or have any undercoat. Would you look up here? She's like, yeah, okay. Yes. She's, there she is. Look at that tail. She's got the most perfect pom-pom tail. And seriously, if you ever wanted to show her, they have a great class in CFA for spays and neuters. She would do really well in the premiership class because she's just got a really great personality. She's got a fabulous tail. She's got a beautiful long body. She doesn't mind being handled and she's purring right now. Yes, you are, aren't you? Look at that body. She's hard like a little rock. She's very muscular. It's a really perfect example of the breed. Okay, I'll show them your face here. You can stop purring. I don't know if they can hear you on the other end of this. You're very cute and very unusual. You're one of maybe only five long-haired Japanese bobtails that ever been registered in CFA in this in this uh, country, and we include Japan now, all of North America, and Europe. And I don't think there's been more than five, if that many. So you're very unique in all the world, and you have this amazing personality, like a boy. She's an Ella daughter, and she is just fearless and loves to play and purr and be in your lap. Come here. And somebody wants to love you and take you to California. Wouldn't that be fun? Wouldn't that be fun? And uh, she's out of Ella, Ella Ashlyn Ella, which is the Disney character for the daughter of Cinderella, her mother, her grandmother is Cinderella, and that is Naota's mother, I'm pretty sure. Anyhow, she's got that fabulous Cinder personality. She's got really pretty eye color, too. It's a really gold green. It's kind of outlined around the edges. Very dramatic, and she's got the perfect torty blaze up her front of her face, and her coat is like a, what a good torty should be. It's mostly black with patches of cream and red on it. You're so good. I wish I could show you more of her personality. I've taken her into the bathroom here, and she's like, what's the deal? I don't know this room. But she did go out and play, was playing with the kittens out in the living room, Smokey's kittens. She was up the head button the kittens like, hi, friend. So she's the kind of cat that gets along well with other cats. Hey. Yes, you're very pretty. You're very special. If CFA were having shows, I would be keeping you and showing you because you're pretty amazing. She's like, yeah, I know it. I know it. Anyhow, very easy going, great personality, fabulous body, beautiful pattern, amazing pom-pom tail, and just a love bug, ain't you? She's like, yeah, I'm a love bug, I'm a love bug. Yes, I have a funny face to some people, but there's been a mad rush on torties lately. Everybody wants one. Like, this is, that's because we're so special and there's only a few of us on the planet. Hey. And I've practiced with her because I had planned on showing her if I kept her. So she's like really good at, at being held and looked at. and She doesn't panic or try to get away. She's very relaxed. 
and uh, you know she's good for standing on the table and being stretched like they would do in a show ring. So if you ever wanted to show her, she should be a great show cat. She's been prepped for it from the time she was a little bitty baby, being stretched and playing with the kitty tees. And so she would be raring to go, but if she doesn't go to a show, she'll make a great pillow buddy for you. Okay, this is my, I, I nicknamed her Tortitude because she has so much attitude. She's, like I said, she's a female with the personality of a male. But she hasn't been officially registered, so you could name her whatever you, whatever you'd like. Okay, here we go. Say goodbye. It's hard to do this with no help. Yes, yes. You want to go to California? Wouldn't that be fun? Back to mom's old home state. Look at her making bread. To the total love. I think you'd be very happy with her personality. And like I said, she's, she's old enough she could be spayed. Some vets don't want to do it until they're about six months old. She was born on January 17th. So she's just, let's see. She's going to be five months old. So, but she's still got a lot of kitten in her. You know, she'll be a kitten until she leaves this planet. And that's the great thing about cinder kids and cinder grandkids. Yes, you're very cute. Look at you beside the, the cat that's holding the um, the toothbrushes. Isn't that a cute little picture? Here. Now we just got to see if your new potential mom really wants you or she wants to wait for something else. Yes. You want to do some grooming, and I keep playing with the kitty tees. There you go. Look at that body. Look at that stance. Look at that tail. You're amazing, Tortitude. You are amazing. Yes. You look really good on the granite. Okay, that's my Tortitude. She's ready. Over here. I'm going to go outside and play with the kittens, huh? So if I can like, take some more. Look at that proud strut. You've got a, quite a little strut there, girlfriend. Okay, let's take you out and see if you'll play with the kitties. Here's little Tardy Tube doing some exploring here. Come here.